Okay, so I'm just going to have a look here. I've got a question for 2018, question one. So identify a compound of calcium that is one of the main causes of permanent hardness. You're only asked to identify, so calcium sulfate or CaSO4 will get you your marks. Describe the procedure used to measure out 50 centimetres cubed of the hard water from a beaker into a tank of glass. That's your use of a pipette. So wash out with the ionised water, then with the hard water sample. Um, then uh, using a pipette filler, draw two twenty-five 25 centimetres cubed of hard water. Um, reading from the bottom of the meniscus when red at eye level, when the pipette is vertical. Transfer into the conical flask, touching the tip of the pipette off the side of the conical flask for drainage time. Next here you're asked for a name the indicator added to the conical flask, a rhea chroma solid chrome black tea. Then you're asked what colour was observed using this indicator in the presence of M2 plus. The M2 pluses are calcium ions what cause my hardness, so it's wine red, and then at the end point it changes to blue. Um, a small volume of another solution was added to the water sample before commencing the titrations. The other solution is a pH 10 buffer. Do include 10, okay, the actual buffer number. And the solution is added because it's the pH at which the indicator works best. Now, there is a good few ways in which you can phrase that if you want to have a look at the marking scheme. I would also, um, this is what a buffer actually does. So just to make sure you get your full marks, I would include there that resistance changes to pH. The final one then, I'll come back to part E in another video, otherwise the video will be too long. Um, suggest a way to determine if this water supply contains temporary hardness. So we boil the water sample. Remember, temporary hardness is hardness that is removed by water. Any of those um, temporary hardness waters um, when they're boiled, will leave a scale. Okay, so your lime scale on your um, on your on your your um, electrical metal components. Okay, um, so that is your full marks there.